Welcome back to another Waist Beauty video. My name is Tatiana, and if you didn't already know, I have a customizable beaded jewelry business where I hand make waist beads, bracelets, rings, thigh beads, all that good stuff. And as I said, everything is customizable, so you can choose your colors, you can add angel numbers, charms, all of that. As you can already tell by the title, on today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a elastic waist bead and anklet set. So this is a uh, reference waist bead that we're going to be making. So this is a blue, white, and gold themed elastic waist bead with stones on it. So yes, you can also add stones to your custom waist beads if you choose. To achieve this look, you are going to be needing some elastic stretchy string. I use Crystal Tech. I use size 1.0. I find it to be a lot thicker than the other ones. You're going to be needing some blue beads. You're going to be needing some white beads. Gold beads. And your stones. Alright, so your very first step is to take all of your measurements. So we're going to measure the waist right around. Remember to always leave a little extra room for tying. Take your scissors, cut that off, and put it to the side. Next, you want to measure your ankle. Again, leaving some room for tying. Take your scissors, cut. So the first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have one end secured so we're going to start with the waist bead and of course this is something that can be done with the bead spinner which is what i would typically use but i do want to show you guys that this is possible without the bead spinner and for people who don't have one you can still make these items so first what i like to start with is the stone section so we're going to take a gold bead first and just do a random pattern using the stones One time. So gold, stone, gold, stone, stone. Now that you have this beautiful look completed, you just want to keep going in with a random pattern using the rest of the beads. So I'm going to go in with a white. Blue. Gold. Stone. Gold. White. And just keep going. So you just want to continue with this. It's looking so pretty and intentional. Like, of course, everything is so randomized, but like, it looks good. <laughs> So putting on the last like, two beads. Now we move on to the tying, which is the trickiest part if you ask me. This is the completed waist bead. It turned out so beautifully, as I knew it would. <laughs> Get into these details. I love it so much. Now it's time to move on to the matching anklet. So of course, the first thing that you want to do is secure the end. We don't need these beads falling off as we put them on. Just need to add a couple of more stones. Let's get into these ones here. 
Temple ones. These. And we're just going to start off the same exact way that we did with the waist bead. So you're going to do gold, stone, gold, stone, and then just repeat this. And of course, we're going to keep going with our randomized pattern. It's random, but it is a pattern. <laughs> so we're almost done here with our anklet. And of course, it's turning out beautifully. This is a really nice color combination. If you guys have any suggestions or any other combos that you guys want me to make, definitely let me know in the comments. I am willing to try other colors. I'm honestly not one to typically wear blue, but I really love this. I love how these turned out. We're done here. I love how these turned out. I think it looks so, so nice. Give it a little... Okay guys, so we are back after that unfortunate incident, but it's okay, it happens all the time, you just have to pick up the pieces and put it back together. <laughs> so now we just have to quickly tie this and then we are done. So this is the finished anklet. It looks so pretty and I'm really, really pleased with the way it turned out. Alrighty, so for all of our elastic waist beads, they are stretchy, obviously. So to put them on, you just step into them like a pair of pants, just like that. Pull them up and look at that. I think it's so nice. It came out so well and it fits perfectly. And the anklet, of course, is also stretchy. So you just wanna stick your foot in there. And look how pretty that is. This is literally perfection. If I do say so myself. And I do. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope that you were able to follow along, okay? If you guys do end up making any of these items, be sure to send them to me because I like to see your versions. Also, if you guys have any suggestions of things that you guys want me to make, be sure to say it down in the comments below. Or you guys can send me a request on Instagram at Waste Beauty, and I will be sure to make those items with you guys. And as always, be sure to shop wastebeauty.ca.